Hello, my name is Lena Ullman and uh, I just released a new album called uh, Skating Across the Baltic with uh, Ivor Otley uh, and I'm going to play a track from that album. It's a tune I wrote, it's called Halloween Waltz. magic it's 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 real dream tapestry music mm -hmm. very unusual i never heard anything like that in the shop before and usually we'd associate the five string banjo with with, with the likes of maggie barry or luke kelly or liam clancy mm -hmm. you know back in yeah. ballads and that yeah. kind of stuff so yeah. god it's 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 just so gentle so relaxed so 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 as i say dream inducing music okay fantastic okay Five string banjo, very unusual here, and a Swedish person playing music in East Clare, even more unusual. Yeah. So how did you end up out there? Um, well, I, from, from an early age, I, was, I picked up the banjo when I was 15 in Sweden, playing old, uh, American old time music. And um, um, after a couple of years, I discovered a trad, Irish trad, and I started coming here a lot. And I, played a little bit of fiddle so I got the, all the tunes in and anyway so I, I've been playing both 
old time music and trad music. Uh, you know, I love them both. You know, and uh, yeah, I started. I put the fiddle up on the shelf, but I, I, the, the banjo was uh, the main instrument uh, always, and um, I picked up the tunes and started going to sessions and that, and and I started composing my own. Lovely, tunes and that's one of your own compositions. It, it was my own composition. Oh. Yeah. And uh, when you find you're very, it's it's beautiful. As I say, it's very, it's it's very kind of trancing music and very gentle and very, very mm -hmm. silken kind of music. How does that fit in to to a full blown session out in East Clare or somewhere? Uh, I mean, the question: Are you heard out there? Uh, how do you mean heard? Uh, heard within a session. Uh, for that all depends. You know, right. How big or how noisy it is, but uh, I suppose yeah, yeah. No, I think it fits in. It it. It lends itself to reels very easily, and um, for um, a long time I refused to go near the jigs because of the right hand technique. Right. But uh, one day I just discovered a way of doing that as well. So. Yeah. Yeah. yeah no. Lovely. And when you when you play your 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 music in a session out in wherever in Clare and East Clare, yeah. do you play melody or do you play do you accompany or do you play a bit uh, of both it's or? Probably a mix of both. Um, but it also depends on the session. If there's backing, if there's a guitar backing the music and the session already, I tend to play more melody because you might clash with the chords and that. Sure, right. Or, um, but if there's no backing, I tend to back more. But right. it depends. Some people want me to back, some people want me to play melody. And, and it's, yeah. And you, do you sing a lot out there as well? Within the session, would you have a few songs thrown in? Mm. Yeah, not in the trad session so much. No. Right, okay. Occasionally, I might sing a song. All right, okay. Now, on the album, you, you, you play with a beautiful fiddle player, Ivor Otley. Yes. Tell me your connection with him, or how did you meet up? Or well, we met in, in uh, Lena's bar, not, not my own bar, but it's short. <laughs> it's called Short's Short Short's now, right, Jerry's, yeah. Yeah, um, in, we met there about ten years ago, and um, I we just connected straight away musically, and... Uh, Start playing a lot, and uh, we had a band with uh, Rob Stein as well. The three of us. Where's Rob from? Uh, he's, he's American. American. Yeah. I remember Rob. Be, yeah. Do you? I do. I do. Yeah. Yeah, and uh, but he moved back to the states, and and uh, yeah, we started recording. We, you know. It, it took a few years now to do this recording, but um, right. And I, Ivor is very good with the arranging, and he's a fantastic fid fiddle player, and he's very good at the arranging of music. And yeah, no, it's, it's, his it's ideas of it, you know. Sure. And yeah, kind of. We 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 got you know click there. I know, yeah. and he'd have spent a bit of time in Sweden as well. He did, yeah, yeah. He's back in, in England now. Right. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, no, and how how did you find when you came to Clare first or Galway or wherever, like sitting in the session? Were you accepted or was it were, yeah, were you looked at yeah, unusually but or? First, uh, people kind of, I think, looked at me. Oh, Jesus, who's that with the banjo? Help, God help us. Right, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but but uh, as, because they often associate the five string banjo with. Um, Bluegrass music yeah. and the finger picks and sure. it can be very very loud. I know. Um, and uh, but I think I, they accepted me. Already, yeah. You know? No, I mean, what jumps out at, at the music I've heard in the album and just even here this morning is the gentleness of it. Yeah. And I could yeah. imagine, uh, I could imagine you backing a, a melody w w would be an amazing experience in the sense that it yeah it would work awfully well. To, you know, it gives it a different sort of flavor. Yeah. And is there any instrument you like backing? Just to talk about backing specifically. Is have you any choice of instrument that you think that banjo gels with really well? Well, fiddle and accordion, I suppose, would be my. Uh, yeah, fiddle, I suppose. Right. So. Yeah, fiddle. Yeah. Okay. No, it is. Listen, it's 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 a Monday morning here, and the what twenty first of August. You're in here early, so I appreciate the fact that you've brought magic into the shop okay. to start our week. And best of luck with the album. I hope it goes really well because Thank you it very much. it is very very special, a very magic album. Okay, thanks. thanks a lot, Lena. Thank you.